Beachy Stout has been charged in connection with the murder of his first wife. Teach them! Always make sure the message I reach them! Viewers, Portland businessman Everton Beachy Stout MacDonald has been charged in connection with the murder of his first wife several years ago. In 2009, Beachy Stout's first wife, Merlene Hope MacDonald, who was affectionately called Petal, was shot dead outside her home at Bonebrook Crescent in the parish. Reports in that incident are that the 50-year-old businesswoman left her business place for her home shortly after 10 p.m. with her four-year-old grandson. She drove into her driveway approximately 10.20 p.m. on the 2nd of May and got out of her Toyota Aria SUV and went around to the passenger side to get some belongings off the back seat. That is when she was ambushed and shot several times in the head and neck. She died on the spot. Mrs. MacDonald was found clutching her handbag between the SUV and the wall at the entrance to her house. Her grandson was not injured. The police reportedly picked up several spent shells from the scene. Off note, Crime Stop along with concerned citizens had offered a $2.1 million reward for information, leading to the arrest and charge of the person or persons responsible for the murder. However, no one was ever arrested or charged for the murder until now. Meanwhile, Beachy Stout was also charged in relation to the gruesome murder of his second wife, 32-year-old Tonya MacDonald, affectionately called Sassy. Tonya's partially burnt body was found in the Sherwood Forest area with her throat slashed. Everton MacDonald and his two co-accused, Denvalin Minot and Asha Barnes, were taken into custody in August of 2020 during a series of coordinated operations in Portland. Minot, who was also arrested and charged in connection with Tonya's killing, pleaded guilty in the Home Circuit Court in September of last year and was sentenced to 19 years in prison. After his guilty plea, prosecutors divulged details of a witness statement Minot gave police investigators, claiming that Beachy Stout offered him $3 million to kill Tonya. Minot also admitted that he hired another man to carry out the crime and said he watched as the man stabbed the 32-year-old businesswoman repeatedly. Teach them! Hey yo, hello! Send the message and make it reach them. It's teach them right here. Warlord representing. Thank you for watching. Like the video before you go. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. And remember to share the video with your friends and family. And browse the channel for more quality content. Until next time, walk good, my friends. Teach them!